hey guys welcome um this is going to be a free video that will be included in the fiber cash formula and it's going to be added to this other gigs fiber cash formula is a brand new video course that I created for people any for everyone from newbies to even the experts that will show you how you can go from zero to making your own in six figures online so um, just like i've been doing also you can see from my screenshots down here for you to get this fiber cash from lot to lay your hands on this course you'll have to come to um fiber cash from .com for you to get your own copy so um this will be added to the other gigs here because um we have some other gigs that we've created here that we've added here so there, there, there are about um, five parts in this course and all of these parts were already done except this particular part and this other gig that's actually my plan for this other gig i'm going to be doing series of them um, free videos like this that will be added so they are gigs that you can do on fiverr most of these gigs are not common and many of them will be free almost free to do and they will be easy as well just like the one we are getting into here so this particular service that we uh, that we want to talk about here is called um, is actually about um, I we can call it IPR blog posting. Some people can say um, guest post, but it's actually been um, the idea is helping people post on your own blog that is of some IPR maybe PR four, PR three, PR five, as much as possible. So. We'll, Normally, this is this is something that would normally would have took some time. It's going to take some time for you to be able to get a blog that will, that will have all these IPRs. But I'm going to show you a, a very fast track method for you to actually start selling these services. And this is a kind of two way service, like I'm going to do in the title. So it's a kind of two way service because you can actually make posts for them and then again you can still come back and then do blog commenting as well on your blogs so what we are going to do here is very simple you can see these guys are selling you are still going to come back to how you can have several twists in this niche but first things first i would like to show you how you can get this ipr site so it is very simple and then kind of straightforward so all you need is uh, an account with expired domains.net you can type this down <coughs> you can write this down um you can just pause the video and write this down expired domains.net so you have to register and you can see that i'm logged in to my own account so what you need to do is you just come to when you come in like this okay let me just go back to the home page let me go back to the home page so when you come like this this is all you're going to get so you now come to deleted.com you can do dot mobi dot st dot mx dot uk dot anyone that you want dot info but the reason why i'm going to choose dot com i'm going to tell you later but and you can do anyone you like really but let me just click on dot com for now for the purpose of this guide so you now have to come down here and apply some filters so filter so start with so if you want a if you want a domain in a specific niche you can just put maybe health or maybe cooking or maybe travel anything you want here the niche that you want the domain to be in i'll tell you why you can want to do that later but for this for the purpose of this i'm not going to choose any so i'm going to check off i'm going to come to this page rank and I'm going to check off no fake PR so that we are not getting domain with fake PR. Then, actually, I normally use leave this um, on touch sometimes, but I'm going to leave it uh, on touch. Then, no PR less than minus one. Then I'll come down here and say only available domain. So I'll come back to I'll now come to add dot and SEO filter. Then I would use domain authority 10. I will say minimum of 10 as well for the page authority this is the main authority and this is page authority normally when i was starting out i normally just leave this off but these days 
when it comes to it's not only PR that counts for website anymore things like this count as well so um, I think there's a place that you can set backlink but I don't once you set the page authority and domain authority normally that one those ones should be enough but just for the purpose of this I'll say a domain name that already have some backlinks so the purpose of what we want to do here is we want to find a domain name that is expired that some that has been dropped so you can just quickly go and register that and set up our blog on it or anything like that so i will sort by pr by page rank so you can see we have page rank 4 page rank 4 page rank 4 which is the highest for the ones with but if you you should decide to just um to check this off um this um if you leave this empty you're going to get some more better results as in much more larger results but because this domain authority and page rank authority is kind of a um i would say it's kind of important these days and that's why i just le let it be there but i'm going to now click on this unsure pr because uh, these ones are the ones that it, it is unsure of what their pr is so it's not sure if this is page rank four and it's only sure of this one that it, this one is page rank four and um if you go down there you find some but i don't want to waste time so i'll just click on unsure that is not sure doesn't mean it is not in the page rank i'll tell you why later so i, I apply the filter again oh. didn't i check that off show filter okay i didn't so i'll apply the filter again So when I click on the um, when I reapply the filter, you can see that the ones in the orange um, something are gone. The one with the orange um, something are gone. So we are only left with the ones that um, expire domain is sure of their own PR. That it is sure that the their PR is right. The reason is because we, we are not going to just go and register this domain. We will still come back to check their page rank. So normally I use these sites before. And there's one other side that I use. I check rank, but that one I think they are not um, doing well these days. But this one is just in the tell you that possibly fake PR. But I just got this one today, and they look okay to me. So SEO Mastering dot com stroke and fake. I think PR page rank. I think checker dot PHP. So he's saying this does not match any document let's see what i'm going to say for this so i i think it is not sure of their page rank but i'll look for another one so that's what we are trying to get there so we want to be sure we just want to be extra careful that this page rank is not fake because it's very common to get some fake pr so this one is saying fake pr for the one that this one said is not unsure of so it's kind of it's going to be kind of right to fake PR, there is a way to determine if the PR is fake or not. So, despite the fact that we used all these, um, despite the fact that we use all these, um, all these filters, but what I'm going to do so that we will be able to get a domain name, so that I will show you the next step you need to take. I will just come here and say, I will come and stop this. I'm, I'm going to come and remove this backlink. I will let it be. Then I'll also let this TA and then the PAB as well. But we can just okay, okay. But I'll, I'll let them be too. I will let them be too. So I'll just go with no DA. And no. You can see that we have a much more larger resource this time. So let's say we want to check this brilliant mastery stuff. So let's say you want to test this ma brilliant and um, mind mastery i'll just copy that and then i would check that here check pr so it's saying possibly fake pr because it's saying it does not get any but this domain name is probably going to be a good domain i've actually seen that's why i'm not really going with these sites that's why i did not like them that much 
is going to tell you that possibly fake PR. That doesn't mean it is fake. You can see what this one is saying. It's telling us that this page rank is valid. That the page rank is valid. So I would I would stick to this particular um in fact I'm bookmarking it right now. I'm going to bookmark this. So I'm going to be sticking with this particular page rank checker. Fake page rank checker. So I'm going to check this off. So um normally this is okay. You can just go to GoDaddy and then register this domain name like that and start offering what is this about you can just mix put some post on it brilliant mind, mind mastery i don't know this one is going to be good for a kind of self-help niche or something you can use this for motivation and things like that but um one thing i'll still do is i will go and check i'll come to arefs.com you need to register too because i think they allow only about two to three times for people to check if they are not um, registered with them so i will put this domain name then we are going to see if it is really what is for the guys but it is saying no results for specified domain area so i will check this another this is another site i like to check open site explorer so i will put the domain name here as well there's probably no so there is a domain authority of five and this is a um, page authority of 15. is a page rank theory site and how many years have it has, has it been on brilliant mind mastery so it, it was registered on, in 2011 so this is a age this is a good old domain name. so let's see if it is available they are telling us here that it is available where they are telling us that it is available we will confirm if it is available on go that day so on go that day we will know if it is really available so i've copied the domain name so yeah i will just take this um the domain name is brilliant mastery I think I've, I've copied it before but I'll just copy it again then I'll paste it here search domain so it has been taken <laughs> so it has been taken but what we're going to do is we are going to just I will say let's check some more let's see some more domain names um, I'll just this time around I'm not going to do all those checks I'm not going to run those checks I'm just going to pick some domain names and try to see I believe this would have been taken let me see this one people don't want to register something like this so I'll just check normally if you if you need a domain name you'll have to be here constantly and don't forget that um, don't forget that dot com is not the only place you can go so this one is available just like i thought it would be so it's available and you can go and register this particular domain name if you want and then um, there's one thing i want to tell you about this good adding the reason why i preferred good at is because um if you want to register with good added there's this software that you can use it's called them um, continue to let me continue to cut it's called only it's not a software it's actually a chrome add-on so it's called only if you type chrome add-on on I, I believe that should bring you so this is the only you can come and register it you can come and register it is going to find coupon for you on good on good at this so I'll click continue. I just want to show you that now that I will register, I already have some domain names there. So if you now, no matter, I'll just register for one year. That should do. Then I would, before I go to proceed to check out, I'll click on this only and I'll click on apply coupon. So it's going to look through the domain names and give me a good price. You can see the original price was 13 it actually come to come down to 10 
and it's going to go to as low as maybe even 0 0.9 1 point something depending on the number of uh, number of coupons that they have at that time depending on the kind of coupons they have i think they have 16 now so it's going to apply all of them and then it's going to choose the cheapest one of them so only is still going on still working on the site and let's see it's saying it only got nine it only got us to nine but that's not what I, so i'm not going to register this what i will do is i'll just come to google and say it happens like that sometimes on on depend they might not have a lot of so i just say go daddy do that the do that the coupon no know what I want to do go do that the coupon Let me just see this. So this is, I think this is a site I've used in the past. So you should be able to get some coupons like that. Like this one now, they say is seven percent cash back. Hmm. <coughs> well, I will go back to Google. I think I've used that site in the past. I don't know what is wrong with them. So this is retail me notes. I'll still come down. So let's see. We'll, I'm definitely sure we'll see coupons I would so this one is saying okay let's let's actually show coupon so this is a coupon I'll copy this and then I would come to go daddy we are we on go daddy okay so we'll come down here and manually apply this domain apply the coupon that we copied so you got the one is cj then i'll click on apply i probably have used this coupon before so i would i think it's because they are similar that even these ones are not bringing enough but what normally that one didn't work now so we we'll just have to keep going these are some more 80% off that's come to me so that one did not work I will copy this but I'll pause this video and then until I'm able to get one that worked until I'm able to get one that will work but let's see if this one will work I probably have used that one before because I registered a lot of domains on GoDaddy I do a lot of registrations here so that one did not work so maybe i will use it so i'll pause this video and then i will keep trying until i'm able to get one that would bring this down i just want to do it i just want you to know that you can actually buy domain name for less that's how much that's it. that's how i bought most of my domain names on good as okay yeah so finally i was able to get one to work and you can see this is the domain name that we're trying to register normally i'm not going to register this domain name and i'll advise you not to register a domain name like this not because of the iphone but because this does not even make any sense so um if you want to register just click on proceed and then you enter your any of this your card my gtb card works my visa card of um, access bank works and my pioneer card from fiverr works as well so and once you register you register this domain name you will need the next thing we need is a website um a hosting account so where you can get this hosting you can normally i just used old swings for my own registration i use 
I use an IP, I buy an extra IP for each of the each of the domain names that I'm putting on them. But what you can do here is this you can just um, come to somewhere like this freewebhost.com and then you sort all these. You can even get this thing for free. You sort through these guys and then you look for maybe one that would give you a free stuff. And all you have to do is this. So you can see there are a lot of them that you can register free domain name from. Most of them they will have upsell as in maybe they are free is for just your first site and they would put a limit like maybe 20 MB or 50 MB or 100 MB. I don't really play around much with this, but I'm just thinking that if you don't have the money to spend, this is a good place. And another place you can use that I will recommend is hostwins.com. And then um, hostwins is what where I use, is where I'm registered, is where all my domain names, all my hostings accounts are registered. That's where all my website are registered. So is it going? Is it not going? So I'm not going to go through how to register a zip C panel. Something is wrong with my website. Please then I'll quit the process again to check my internet connection, please. Okay, so just as I was suggesting, I was um saying the data and this one is giving you one gig um okay, this is actually giving one gig MB uh, one gig um free web space and these ones are giving to that's the one i checked the data i don't know if they support um if they will be able to support um but they don't have a free wordpress installed which is something i'm not going to that's why this free domain is not be the best <coughs> free hosting rather you're looking for one that will be able to, where you'll be able to host your own WordPress because WordPress is the easiest thing we can use here. This one is giving 20 gig. And I don't think they have WordPress too. What you're looking for is um, either Fantasy School or what do they even call that? Thing? Or Soft Softpedia or Soft um, Soft Faculous. But I don't think they have any one of the two. So I don't think the I don't think any one of these two have that. But easily you can come to host rings and just register a single what you need is um this you, you can use this here Justin. Use your biggest line is around five dollar per month. Five dollar per month will take you will be enough. Okay, it's now six dollars, six point five dollars per month. So this is ultimate. You can host as many, as many VPN as possible. But the thing is, um, they, they now use if once a single um dedicated IP. But you can ask them to maybe you can pay an extra one dollar per, per every domain name you are hosting there. But um. I think there are many more sites that you can use. You can just come to um there is one domain name. Okay, let me just type um hosting cheap host. There is one forum cheap hosting. There is one domain, there is one um forum like that. Where you can get all these um hosting for cheap price okay I would say one dollar hosting most of these you find from one dollar web hosting I don't know I've not used these guys before but you can just what you need is you don't need a an expensive domain name uh, sorry you don't need to go on the high side like I'm doing but what I would suggest is that you look for a cheap domain name service if you can find one. But there's actually a forum. I don't remember that forum now, but I can just pause this video again and find that forum for you so that I'm not I'm not wasting time finding it.
Okay, yeah, so this is the forum that I'm talking about, web hosting talk. Just come here and buy all you need is a shared hosting service. Sorry about that. So you can just come to webhostingtalk.com, browse through the site, and then you'll find what you need is a shared hosting that should do you for the for a start. So just browse through this forum, share the hosting offer. You can come to this side and look for cheap hosting. Most of them will take PayPal. You can use your Nigerian PayPal, and some of them are going to take credit card from you. But I would advise, I would strongly advise against paying with your credit card because all these guys you don't know them, and you don't know some of them are just be scammers. You understand that? So this is a one dollar hosting now, one dollar hosting. And they have this soft fact loss. So this soft fact loss is going to give you a WordPress as in with this soft fact loss you can install WordPress on your site. I'm not going to go through all that on so, so you just have to do I'll just tell you what you will do. Just set up the WordPress. There are several um, videos on YouTube that will show you how to install a WordPress. And then um, later I'm going to create another video that will be free like this one also that will show you how to install wordpress um, because wordpress installation is another good service on fiverr I'm just telling you that now and then um, you can actually do offer some other templates and things like that so all you need to do is just set up a blog a blog like my own blog here so once you've registered the domain name and then you've done the hosting you link them together i don't think that should be hard so you come to you create a blog like this one here and then you create the, a post for them here so um, many guys uh, there are actually several ways I'm not going to start talking about this if you need a tutorial on how to create WordPress that is not something that is hard for me to get for you if you can't find a tutorial you can just get in touch with me maybe by the time you're watching this video I've not created the other video that I'm talking about I'll just guide I will just lead you to where you need to get the domain name but this one i'm not going to talk about this i was in that you would be able to find out you can do it here this is not what this video is about so um did i close so you see something that many guys are doing there are several ways you can twist this particular service for example you can go with a niche you can say a particular niche like if you want to register a person so you can go to something like dog as in when you are in when you are doing this filter here you can come here and say it contains maybe dog pets anything like that just you just keep going through so if you want to do cooking niche you can say cooking if you want to do recipe you can do recipe if you want to do health you can do with loss things like that anything you want but um there are actually several ways so you can see this on the saying dot co dot uk so if you register let's say for example you want to register a dot co dot uk or, the, or even dot net dot anything you want so dot co dot uk is this so dot uk we're going to bring the menu with dot co dot uk for us you can see them these are a few of them like that there so um back to fiverr so that's Another twist you can add. This one is else. That's a twist, and you can actually do it and post, make it look general. Say, you can go ahead and say, I'll do three backlinks. So there are several ways you can twist this article on my PR3 blog. You can see this one. I don't think this person is mentioning this particular niche. You can call it a guest post, like this person. You can just say you post article you can just say use you do a IPR blog post for them anyhow you want to put it so all you have to do is just put the click and then there is one other way people do it normally you can just post and then all this thing will just keep going like that they will keep pushing down pushing down you see that some have gone to a um, number two here they have gone to pay two here so you can do another one that they call that one um contextual backlinks and it's selling on fiverr as well you can say contextual just type contextual contextual backlinks so contextual backlinks is another so now all you have to do is just make sure their post is 
there's actually i think um there's one way they do it i don't know there's one way they do this this contextual stuff <coughs> um okay so there's actually a plugin that would help you do that will help you list all every post that you make everything would come here nothing will go to page two there's a you can if you go to i think it's called blog row i don't have it here but i normally do have it on my i have about 30 of these um, of, of sites like this and i registered them since last year created the old stuff thing so let me just check i just want to see if the plugin exists add new i want to i, I think it's just blog i don't remember what the name is um blog the zone that i use then i'll just see. i think my network is okay WordPress social blog grow so I think this is it so it's going to show all your blogs on a single file and all your posts all the posts you make so in that case you can come and say you do contextual backlink so you can say you see that most of these guys are mentioning um, I numbers but you just look for a way to put your own contextual blog post I mean, you can say okay you can even come to, i think there, there, there are blog rows that's another link keyword you can use blog row okay. so you can sell how to your blog there are several ways you can twist it and um i just want this to open I think my network is not fast anymore. Okay, so um, one thing you can also do is you can offer to write the article. You know, normally we say we are going to put, we are going to do an article for them. Then this is another person say. I would submit your post on my private blog network because this thing they call them private blog network they are called private blog network and this is someone that is saying I will publish your post on the Altery Home Improvement blog so this is a twist so um, what you, the way this is going to work for you is not if you if you have a single if you buy a single domain name and you're expecting that to work well so you can go and get like twenty dollars minimum i would say minimum minimum of 20 dollars and go and register as many domain names as possible that should get you like um, 10 domain names with all these coupons so i'm going to give you this coupon this are the coupon as in i just copied this coupon from somewhere so i would i would i think i would just add this to the i would look for a way to get this to you by watching as in that you watch this video wherever i'm uploading this video i'll try to add this coupon there uh, so so um and that's that for this particular video and i, I think um it's a bit long <laughs> i really do, don't want to make it this long but i just have to explain everything you need to know so um if you want uh, more ideas like this um you can come to fibercashformula.com and place your order buy this particular um buy this um video course and then you're not going to regret there are actually a lot of videos here i think there are about um, 40 videos at the moment and i'm going to be adding more like this one if you want to add in, i'm going to be adding this one now I'll, I'll be adding to the download list so that people can start downloading it and i will be creating more but normally i don't know you might if you are following me on facebook uh, i think i'll try to always post on facebook but the best place you be able to get this is if you join my list on Fiverr, through Fiverr Cash, um, that's Fiverr Cash Reports. That's how you can join my list. There's actually a free 
ebook there that you can download for free so you can download this ebook for free for free yeah so you just enter your name and then your email address here and then you get the ebook for free you'll be on my list and then anytime i want to send them by the time i'm creating i think i have like um 10 videos to create for these other gigs so and for different niches okay so don't uh, i forgot to even remind you don't forget if you register let's say you have 30 domain names now some of them appear for some of them appear three and some of them appear out too. Please don't go be don't go below PR2. I don't mention I ne I don't remember to mention that. You can register PR6 if you are lucky to find one, PR7, PR even in fact if you see PR9, if you are lucky to find them. But just make sure that the page rank is real and not fake. And then um and I think that's that. So if you have like um ten domain names now, you can go and say you manually post block comment on ten on, on, on 10 IPR blogs or you just you can even list them if you see some people here doing blog commenting I don't know what's wrong with my network now I think it's just doing anyhow or maybe it's the fiber side that is not um okay for now I don't know but anyway um you can do blog commenting you can say you just list them 2 PR4 3 PR4 that you comment there what you can do is you can just disable block you can disable comment because of the spammers or you can just set your comment to not auto approve you it won't be auto approve so you'll be manually approving so when you post yourself you go and approve that and it's simple as it's as simple as that so um, i'm going to end this video here but don't forget to go to fibercashformula.com if you want to be a part you can watch all these videos by being a member i talked about how to get traffic because um if you have these gigs on fiverr and you don't have traffic today that's traffic is i think traffic is the biggest part traffic is the hardest part so if you don't have traffic to these gigs that that's going to be as in there's no way you're going to be making money from it as in if people are not seeing the gigs there is no money coming in and I talked about how to do, how to maximize your sales. This would help as well how to withdraw your earnings. This is my help if you are new to Fiverr. Keeping your account safe is also something that will help. But you can see there are a lot of things in this video in this video course. But where you can get more information is by going to fibercashformula.com. Um <clears throat> my mood is not really that high this morning so i'm just going to end this video here uh, i hope it's not too long <laughs> thank you